My name is Lorenzo the Juggernaut Hunt. I am here with Jeremiah Riggs after an impressive first round knockout at BKFC. Bro, this is your debut. You're doing your thing. How do you feel now? Man, I feel real good. I know it's it's I can tell right off the bat it's a big adjustment. Um, you know, uh, especially the feel. And I know you know, you know, just coming out, you know, it, it's it, I, I I know uh, from just experience, I knew per fight that I was going to get my experience as soon as I the knuckle up and the bell ring. I kind of, you know, I just was kind of trying to feel it out there. Of course, with Eric, you know, he's a real powerful guy. So uh, after I really kind of got a couple of them shots in, I said, okay, it's game on. So uh, other than that, you know, it was just really come together real nice. So I saw the guy swinging some big punches. I saw you bite down and look him in his eyes and decide that you were here to fight. You land some clean counters. What was your game plan going in, and did you know this guy was coming with big power? Yeah, you know, the game plan was really easy, nice and simple, man. Stay in the inside. Don't get caught up into the brawl. I knew Eric wanted to kind of suck me into that, and that's okay. I know I can go into that, into them trenches. But really, I kind of wanted to get outside kind of show everybody uh, the, the real technique that we've been looking at. And, and I, I've been telling everybody from, from day one, man, boxing, MMA, th this has got its own technical techniques. And, uh, man, from the gate, from even uh, going into my camp with Alan Belcher, picking things apart from, from fights that we watched, man, it, it come together real nice for us. I saw you take your time. I saw you look him in the eyes. And even though he was throwing those big power shots, you were landing clean counters. So I knew it wasn't going to be long. I was like, oh, wow. So how did you train for that? Did you know this guy was coming with big power? Yeah, you know, um, I watched a couple of Eric's fight, and then previously from knowing Eric. You know, uh, man, we've been around even since our amateur careers years ago. I always knew Eric could land an early powerful shot, you know. And uh, for anybody that knows Eric, I mean, he hits hard. So uh, with bare knuckle, you know, with me being so new, my, my, my game coming in with really with anybody is really uh, t t like I said uh, I, I wanted to be smaller because because me you know um, you know I, I used to do that same kind of shit so with the camp you know we was trying to like, like let's stay small stay small avoid the big shots just clean straight down a pipe counter um, and you know that that's I think it come out pretty good you know it really did. I think you did an amazing job. I can't wait to see you back in here again. I just want to know what's your plans for the future. Where are you taking this? Man, look, this it's all it's 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 this is my future. I ain't gonna lie, man. Uh, I want to thank David Feldman and and the BKFC uh, family. You know, everybody, uh, yourself included. Everybody's just kind of open arms uh, brought me into this family. And I'm gonna be honest with you, man. I'm not looking to do nothing else, nothing else. And in a 175 pound division, I'm gonna be here. And uh, I plan on being here for the for seal my legacy. I, I don't see anything else for me. Nothing. Well, welcome to BKSC. We happy to have you. A powerhouse. Thank you very much. I'm Lorenzo Hunt with Bare Knuckle News. No one beats us to the punch.